time to start dreaming more World of Final Fantasy. <laughs> As I put in the title, we're working towards the true ending now. After the fake out ending of last time. We made a little bit of progress towards the last time because we managed to uh, do Bahamut or Tia Bablio, you know. Whatever it is. So World of Final Fantasy. Yeah, so we're gonna pick up where we left off and keep doing that. Gotta get all seven of the uh, Pleiades. All them recruited, build up power, and get ready for that. Which I believe most are done through here. Hello. So. What now? Who's I gotta someone? intervene in more stuff. Which, as per usual, I won't be talking through a lot of. Just because I like, you know, other people about to enjoy cutscenes and whatnot. So. We're gonna do it. We're gonna make progress, and uh, yeah, I might try and double summon uh, behind it. This because he's still quite powerful. Okay. If Quistus's information is correct, then it's almost time. Balam Garden has been summoning a demon. That's what the reports have been saying. Do you believe it? Of course I don't. All right, then what do you think this alleged demon really is? Do you mind looking into it for me? All the sightings so far have been reported to be around the same hour. Strange. This demon that's appearing. I wonder what it could be. Oh, so I'm a demon now. What a fascinating allegation. Huh? So... Level with me here. What do I look like to you? To be totally honest, you fit the description. Oh, a demon then? Yes, I know who you are. You're one of the demon dyad servants from a century ago, Diabolus. I'm a what now? Oh, I see. So Grimoire decided those two were demons, huh? But how does them being demons make me a demon too? They're servant! So then tell me why you would show up now, amid such chaos. You know why I've come. A servant of demons has no purpose but this. Furthering the chaos. <sighs> then, I must punish you in the Keeper's absence. Would ruin all my fun. Oh, I'm so scared. Not! Yeah. Wait, what? You're facing us now. Huh? Oh, it's you two. What are you doing here? Oh, you know, just butting in to help? Yeah, what Ranger said. We're rearing our ugly ends. What's that even mean? Wait, where am I? What strange place have you taken me? Ha ha ha! We've got him sweating now. No matter. Let's see if either of you wants to steal any good! Yeah, the Hobbit's quite powerful. I do like his design in this. And I will say, I think his worst design is that it ends. But I've seen it at least. Anyway. Good luck with that. He can do some damage, but it doesn't matter. Vomit's not going to be out in long enough for a lot of these things. Why do I just... I don't have any abilities equipped? What? Do I have to re-unlock his shit? Because that'd be quite annoying. What is going on here? It's fine, but... I should have abilities. Ah, it's fine, it's... I mean, again, we're just gonna wear down Diablos a bit, so that's okay. Son of a bitch. Did not think I'd have to re-equip his abilities, so I'm gonna have to do that next time. Simple enough. I've got 
three more attacks. Yeah, so the thing that makes Diablo a very annoying thing is his whole gimmick is uh, status effects. So, yeah, he'll just keep stacking them and just be an absolute nightmare to deal with because of it. Okay, so how much health do we actually chew through with that? Because quite a bit, actually, quite a bit. Oh, yeah, just can keep putting both of them to sleep. So. I mean, he's almost down, so it's, it's fine. We'll just keep powering him down. It's not a big deal. No trouble at all. Predictable. I'm just kind of disappointed I have to relive with Bahamut. What's the point in me going, hey, I've got all my stuff, if you're not going to let me have it all equipped? Behind Bahamut does have abilities, he should be able to use them. Fast. I can't fight here. <gasps> you can't escape. So, yeah. What's this? Just a dream. A very bad one. Every item that's gonna be a problem. Shock. Huh? Brother? Yes, that's right. I've been searching for so long. For me? Of course. You know, when I first heard the news, how you'd fled after becoming an architect, I was so worried. You came after me? But you had it all. You were the exceptional one. I know that mom and dad pressured you into it. Becoming an architect. What's wrong? You can tell me. After you left and went to the cathedral, the house got so unbearable. We tried, but we couldn't reach you. Mom became sick with worry. And dad just hid in his bottle. Fire broke out, and then they were gone. What choice did I have? The cathedral was the only place I, I could think to go to. So then you're telling me, you killed mom and dad? What? No! You put them in the ground. You were always making trouble for them. You never did them an ounce of good. You grew tired of their scolding. So one day, you made them burn. No. I would never do something... But you did. You're saying... that I... Yes. And now that Mom and Dad are no more, my job... is to see you punished. You want me... to atone? For what I did to them? I want... you dead. You are the worst kind of sleazy creep. How dare you peep at people's thoughts without asking them? And you think it's okay to twist her weaknesses around when the poor girl doesn't even know what's real? You scum! This shit, scum! Wait, hold on. Didn't we settle this last time? Last time? Yes, we did just fight. Why am I only remembering these things now? Oh, interesting. When he left this place, do you think his memory got some kind of readjustment to match the world he went back to? Oh, I get it. So then, the reason we forgot about Grimoire is surprisingly simple. It's because we left it. Huh? Hey Rain, what's up? Oh, it's nothing. I'm just starting to piece together how this power of fantasy thing affects our memories. Huh? The power of fantasy? Rubbish. That is my tribe's domain. Now I see. Guardians of time have been busy. Fine. 
If that's how you want to play, then so be it. Come on! Uh, what makes sense? I don't want to do this. We don't have a plan here. Uh, let's do Thunderbolt. Mainly because I want to get this inch out of here as fast as possible. I am weak to dark. That's not good. Uh, hang on. Uh, is it this button? Yeah, it is. So you are weak to light. That is good to know. Shit, they got too much health for that to work. But also weak to light. Uh, focus down the imps. That is the plan. That is what I'm gonna do. Oh, that's real bad. Uh, okay, what do you got? Do you have any option out of this? Cure. No, you don't. So what you're gonna do is defend. Are both characters weak to dark? Because that's actually really bad. Really, really bad. Uh, uh. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here... Hold on! How are you- you just barely clung in there. That's frustrating. What do I need for Kiraga? I need seven? Okay, maybe another round to defend. You need another round to defend. Shit. Okay. Uh, defend as well. Yeah. Uh, no, we need to keep the defense up. Sleep, that's fine. Uh, okay. You can now cure Aga and get us back in this fight. Wave cannon. It's a bit expensive from what I want, but I think it'll get... Yeah, it'll get that imp out of there. Vanisher is five, so I can't do anything. So defend. <laughs> it just ignore my defense? Because I. Hmm. Yeah, Siphon's not gonna do shit. So what you're gonna do? Destroyer. And Banashira. This is on Nightmare, so... Okay. Again, things hurt. I might be max leveled, but things hurt. Gravija. Oh, that's... That's frustrating, to say the least. Nightmare, shit. Yeah, it's basically a free turn, because he's going to then do that, and Poison Nails. Okay, what can I do on this? Regen. Self. Yeah. Abilities. Regen the other one. Good. And you are just going to throw another, uh, another Banashira. Where is it? Turns out, Bahamut is very helpful. Defend, defend. Shit. I am sucking right now. Uh, Whisper Wind. Yeah, that'll keep me in. You have Kira, don't you? 
Is that a stack ability that you just don't have because Zap sucks? Yeah, it looks like it. Uh, okay. What is my option here? Yeah, I don't have great stacks, and that's that's my fault. I also hate this minimalist HUD. I would like to actually know what my status effects are. Nightmare. Defend. Ugh. Yeah, see, the problem is that I, for some reason I don't get Regin procs when I have poison. The two just opposed, and I get one or the other. That sucks. Yeah, he's gonna poison nail me to death if I let him. This is just... Again, it's just a pain, because the whole thing is he status affects me, which means I don't... It doesn't matter if I block it or not. Uh, as soon as that. Again, poison's just... Absolute pain in the ass. I'm gonna keep doing this shit and getting everything cleaned. It's a risk, but I'm gonna do it anyway. He still has Gravija. Yeah, funnily enough. These big status effect moves, <laughs> they are very consistent. <laughs> so I don't have to worry as much about... Like, he's not going to chunk my health very quickly. But I need to build up... So I can throw this. I also don't have any great abilities on you for this sort of thing either. That sucks. Yeah, Nightmare is just like, hey, everyone's out of the fight. <laughs> like, there's nothing I can do about it. I'm gonna poison nails. And then I'm going to just Kiraga. Get everyone's health back up to the high values. And as soon as off this poison. So he's just gonna keep spamming nightmare until I can't until I die of that attrition. Which is why I have to kinda of take it slow. should I do? Uh, let's Thundara him, I guess? Mm. Yeah, he's just gonna spam Nightmare. Yeah, what I do depends on who he wakes up. That's the thing. Okay, you're back. It's great. That is less great. Yes. Unfortunately, I just keep doing Destroyer. Because, yeah. He's just gonna spam Nightmare though, which makes it so it doesn't matter. Ugh, <laughs> uh, okay. Soon, uh. 
Like, again, I'm in no danger here. Well, that's not true. But I'm in basically no danger here, and, uh... It's kind of funny to me. Like, there's not a lot Diablos can do to me that'll actually hurt, per se. Because he's able to just keep me down, but he's not able to finish it. So, what we're gonna do is just make sure the one who can do this shit ton of damage. He had Banish Hira. Almost dead. Uh... Gravija. Ton of my life, gone. That's fine. Yeah, you should be just about dead, so I'm gonna take the risk. Yeah! You can go suck it. Yeah, so if I had actually been able to use Bahamut fully, that would have been a much easier fight, probably. Boss me around like you used to. Well, I don't remember too much about the things we used to have you do, but if you can keep it in check, then maybe, maybe you can have some fun. Huh? huh? We're just. Huh? I might just be imagining it. But if you helped me out, thank you, Rain, Lon. Yeah, okay, so I'm gonna go do things, yeah. Like, he's got those abilities, so why doesn't Bahamut have them? What is going on there? Anyway, let's figure that one out. Because they took them all the way! Ugh. It keeps his levels, which is nice. But he doesn't have any of his actual abilities. Ugh. Why would you do that to me? Which explains why his stats seemed a little low. Uh, okay. Hang on, let's sort. Where I, if you're giving me another flare, I need to put a get rid of a flare. That's the thing, or something. I don't need resist defense down. That so I will discard that. Mainly because I want to get the sink board done. But we'll try routing around it, see what happens. Nope, I gotta get the flare energy jewel, which is quite frustrating. Bunch of blank spaces. Mega flare. Mirage board mastered. Uh, single target mirror. Tickle. Last stand. Magic plus. Plus, that's 50 more magic. Okay, that's something. Wind resistance can't get confused. So, of these, I want magic plus plus. More damage. Yeah, it's fine. If I new game plus, I'm gonna lose it anyway. <sighs> Since we're here, let's do it for Diablos too. Yeah, 
Yeah, Diablos stats are also. <laughs> he's so low that his stats he's low level to his stats are low too. Yeah, got Nightmare, which again, powerful ability. I'm also not big on uh, Mega Mirages for the most part. Like giving them abilities and whatnot. But it is what it is. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so. Mm, nah. Let's see if I can do. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, there's another resist sleep. Which... Yeah. So, let's finish you out, get you all maxed up. Raise its physical damage. Subdue so, doesn't matter for a Mega Mirage. Uh, yeah, let's just focus on damage on him, especially if he's gonna do that much. Yeah, uh, again, Megas are you Megas, because they disappear so quickly, I just always feel that focusing damage is the better move. Alright, so what else can I do with you? Well, since I do have some slots open, what can I do with this? Yeah, place a custom ability, yes. Uh, I should have a ton of these seeds for things. I could do meteor holy. Uh, not great. What do you got? Balance, balance, good. Yes. Ah, these are the ones we want. Hmm. I think what I want to put on him is more magic damage, but I think we already got one of the higher ones. So... What I'm going to do is agility plus plus. Plus. Yeah, might as well. Uh, for this other one, we will put in a... In... Hmm. Again, if I had some better seeds, I could do some more stuff with it. We will put in... Um, accuracy, maybe? Uh, and then just to round him out, because he's already getting magic plus plus, rather than just fully dump on that, we'll put a strength plus plus seed on him. So that'll uh, set him out perfectly for what I need him to do. He's a, he's a super tank. It's great. Uh, Zap, can I actually put anything useful on you? Or you're... So you're good. Well, I could put stuff on him, but I'm not going to. Which one of these do you not have any ranks in? Oh, you have blank spaces all over with you. No, it's raw mule? Okay, that's fine. Uh, so, mm, let's take the HP. Yeah, so each of these do affect the other ones. It's good to know. Or remember, because I have done this before, but just, it's been a long time. Okay, so that'll, that'll play. We've done that. Now, hopefully we don't get into another... Real shit fight like what that now? last one. So I've got to deal with uh, ancestral acrimony. <sighs> so we're fighting Leviathan. I'm kind of weak to water, aren't I? <laughs> Mog. Oh, she's been sighted on the low seas, Koopo. Who has? The great sea demon, Leviathan, Koopo. Huh? <laughs> Let her come. I was hoping that beast would return within my lifetime. 
Sildra! Today we avenge them. Your family and my great-grandfather. Our long wait is finally over. Are you ready? <laughs> right! Hen for the low seas! Tell me in two, Koopa! Jib. That was nothing. Lawn and rain. I don't know how you did it. Now, tell me where that demon was spotted. In the waters of Babel. Not far from the Rainbow Shore, Koopo. Yeah. <laughs> Going down a waterfall is not an easy task. Leviathan! Here I am! Show yourself! Come out and fight! If you have the courage! What's all this noise? Who might you be? Oh. So she killed your ancestors. Now? You seek revenge? Aye. She must pay. For my great-grandfather and Sildra's kin. Hmm. As you wish. I'll call her for you. Why oh, must you always raise such a clamor like that? My ears work fine. Little Adamantus. Can't you see? I'm trying to enjoy myself. I have missed these seas. Your reason for disturbing me. Had best be good. We're the ones who are disturbing you, Leviathan! Well now, what is this tiny creature? I'll show you, Tiny! You killed my great-grandfather Tycoon. He died. With all of Sildra's clan. But on this day, we will have our vengeance! And I'm here to help, Koopo! Tycoon and... Sildra, did you say? Oh! Astonishing! So their bloodline survived! But... Hold. You say you seek vengeance upon me. That's right! Don't you dare feign ignorance! My great-grandfather was brave. When you attacked Sildra's family, he fought to save them. And died. But we swore that one day, we would have our vengeance. For generations we've waited! It's my good fortune that you appeared in my lifetime. Because now... I can be the one to settle the score! Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Foolish girl. Am I to believe a whelp like you has any chance of defeating me? Not a chance. Not in a thousand years. <laughs> 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 What now? Where am I? What is this? It's a fantasy. Where dreams and reality and time all touch. But don't ask me to explain what that means exactly. I guess you might say, when somebody fights our friends, we tag in. You get it? But how can... Oh... You two. How many long years have passed? Can't tell you that, but... Did we really used to know each other? Forget all that. Ferris thinks you killed her great-grandpa and Sildra's family. Is that really true? Well, honestly, I'm not altogether certain myself. As I recall, when Tycoon's crew was attacked by Bismarck's forces, on a whim, I may have helped them to defend themselves. Once I left, any number of villains could have done them in. But that's no concern of mine. Then you mean... Ferris and Sildra are mistaken? So why not just tell them as much? If their hatred for me has been festering all this time, 
then I cannot calm the waves by telling them it was all a big misunderstanding. As such, the wisest course of action is to accept their challenge, to let them break themselves against me. The way you're making it sound, you know they're fighting over nothing, but you still won't let them win? Really? Why would I let them win? I am not beholden to them. They chose this. Then I've got bad news. To fight them, you have to go through us. Well, that can be easily arranged. So, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> oh, wait, I'll just summon Bahamut off the top. And then we'll tank the rest. <laughs> so, let's double check our stats we're looking at here. So, what I want is thunder. That's fine. So what we're gonna do, Mega Mirage Bahamut. So Mega Flare, it's one of those abilities that get stronger the lower the stats I get. It's why I don't wanna ever stack defense on Bahamut. As you said, like if you just saw the Mirage board. Because, again, if he can run low on AP, like, if he's almost out and almost dead, he hits stupidly hard. But, you know. Yeah. I do love how, like, Leviathan, but like, no, I'm pretty calm and reasonable about most of this. It's like, yeah, I'm not gonna just make it. Reaper. Ooh, critical resist. Not bad. Okay, so... Hmm. Wait, Spellga? That's interesting. I need to actually look at descriptions for abilities before I do what I can. So, Mega Flare will do that. Uh, flare is neutral damage. So... Let's do some math. 9, 9, 18, plus 5. Yeah, okay. Okay, I think I can do that. Flare... So I'm not going to get that many turns, but it's fine. And that is Circle. Tsunami, huh? I was really hoping you'd crank out the big ones, but I guess not. Well, we did our best. <laughs> Eat a Mega Flare. <laughs> this would be a reasonably powerful one. My HP is not super low though, so. You're making me really mad. Yeah, we killed him before we could do this when we one v one him. Or two v one. Mega Flare. Six v one if you want to count each individual member member of the stack. Seventy-seven thousand. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's defend off this, but I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So, oh, we got we resist. Yeah. So Bahamut basically won that fight. Who has <laughs> thunder? See how good that does. Yeah. <laughs> So that's how fights are kind of going to go. I hope they punch the shit out of Bahamut. And then uh, hit him with <laughs> hit him with that. So, yeah. <laughs> Maybe not the most entertaining, but it's very effective. Oh, you got me. I have been slain. We won. Really? Oh, yes. Victory is yours. We did it, Koopa! Oi, Adamantus. Can I ask you something? Hmm? A century ago, they tell of a sea demon. But was it really Leviathan? Tell me, why do you ask? 
Oh. Well, I might be imagining it, but she didn't seem like such an evil character. <laughs> Don't be silly. She was, without a doubt, the worst of the Dyad's servants. But no more. You have succeeded at avenging your kin. Oh, good then. Captain! We did it, Koopa! Aye, and you were a big help. Right. Gents, let's go home. <laughs> to think you were once feared as one of the great terrors of the seas. When did you become such a big softy? Quiet, you. There will be trouble if they learn I still live. Now hush, until they're gone. <laughs> and with that, I can now use Leviathan. And Leviathan I didn't use as much either. I guess you can kind of see. Not, not quite that high level, not that strong stats for me. Uh, I'm not gonna use Diabolus. Diabolus is... Yeah, so... Leviathan's 59, so, yeah. We're getting a bunch of lore diaries that I won't be reading on stream. If this game interests you like that, then I would certainly recommend you pick it up and play it. It's not gonna be as easy as I'm making it out to be, or... Well, maybe it could be easy. But I'm playing on Nightmare. Like, the hard difficulty that's kind of meant for this sort of thing. The Butcher! Now, the other thing I probably have to do is deal with, uh, those three. This should be the place I heard about. Traveler, test your strength. Odon. So there you are. The Butcher. You've heard a lot of people. They call me a butcher? Rubbish. I merely challenge fools who would be challenged and they die. Then you're not very sporting. Every one of your victims was cut down without a fight. He who lives by the sword must be quick to draw it. Truly, they met with no foul play. If they expired without a struggle, that attests to their dearth of skill and not my lack of honor. Hmm. It is a troubling thought to be gone less than a century and return to find swordsmanship so diminished. Troubling indeed. How poetic. If it's a challenge you're looking for, why don't you see how you and your principles fare against me? Ah. Uh. Your spirit is impressive. Let us begin. <laughs> mm -hmm. What? Sorry, dude. There's been a change in the lineup. You really ought to know better than to butcher people. I remember you. To fight again after so long would be a thrill. But... You catch me as my blood quickens for another. My first worthy foe in ages. This trickery. This space in which you have confined me. I'll not be detained. What is... Lon! Get out of that thing's way! Aw, oh, dude! Zan. Tets. Ken. <laughs> oh, missed by a hair. <laughs> Good. You're the strongest warrior I've crossed swords with in years. And yet, twould be poor form to pursue this now. Find a new blade. And we shall continue this test of our might. <sighs> Looks like this won't be as easy as I thought. 
Yeah. Yeah. Does he have a weakness? You're taking on Odin? Yeah. I heard that you have experience with the Dyad servants. Basically, anything you can tell me would be a big help. Odin? Hmm. Oh, got it. It's just an old rumor, but... At last. You would try me with the same sword that failed you before? Yeah. Except, I thought I'd mix things up. Hmm? That girl. She looks like Ramuz. It's his grandkid. Grandkid! Hmm. I see you've been sniffing about. Is... is this the best you can muster? Yep. What's wrong? Suddenly you don't look so hot. Hmm. Silence. Make your peace before I cleave you in twain. <laughs> I mean, if I have to hit him with lightning, I can do that. Doesn't help you with that. That's enough what player do we time. have here? Is Odin <gasps> afraid of a widow whitening? Hey, that reminds me. Wasn't Old Ramu the only one you never had the guts to go head to head with? Whoa! Dude, 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 dude! Is that true? What I. I cover before no one! But anyway, let's see if he can actually hurt. <laughs> if he can hurt Bahama. Because if he can, I might have to cut my. Uh... I mean, I already attack as fast as I can to set up Mega Flare. He basically is only going to get two shots at me. Maybe three. Especially since I boosted up. <laughs> I decided to boost Bahamut's B. So. How much are you going to do? 3,000. Okay. Yeah. Flare. Thousand damage. Really, he's still quite fast. Okay. Flare. Double cut. Ooh, fun. Doing more damage is actually in my favor. Ooh, he's gonna get another move. That's great. Still not gonna get me down to critical. There is actually an argument for me taking last stand now that I think about it. Oh, well, he didn't do as much as he could have. That's fine. Mega Flare! <laughs> yeah, so. This is why I like to use Bahamut. Sadly, Ultima doesn't have anything quite in the same league as this Mirage. 80,000. Okay, uh, let's defend. Yeah, I thought that'd be the case. Anyway, you're almost dead. We'll hit you with thunder. <laughs> I could have probably meleeed him and it wouldn't be a problem. Holy shit. That did a shit ton of damage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sadly, Bahamut usually doesn't get experience because he isn't getting the killing blow. So. It's fine. Good. This shall forever stand as proof that your skill surpasses mine. I'm pleased to have met so fierce a warrior. Ours was a duel to remember. That's for sure. But it was a close one. At least, no more travelers will get shorn in two. Ramul, I owe you one. Ramul! Owen, 
I guess I owe Lon and Rain a thank you as well, wherever they are. Now then. And now I can use Odin. Odin I also didn't use a ton. <laughs> Sword the Thunder's Iron, yeah. It cuts everything. That's very true of what he does. Uh, anyway. Because I will not be using Leviathan. Yeah, so it's very clear that I only really used one of those summons a ton. Okay, so I think that's the limit of what I can do. Once, what now? Who's so Let us do one more check. Uh, so I have more things I can do, but these are for... Yeah... So these are extra things I can do. But I think what I need to do is go visit uh, Odin, I'm sorry, Odin, Ramo, Shiva, Ifrit. And fight them. But, and there's a big butt on that. I also might be able to get something back that I really want anyway. Hey. Hey, Seraphie. Sorry to bring it up again, but I was hoping we could discuss Tama. Huh? Tama? Oh, you're talking about Tama Mohime. A long, long time ago. So far back that I can't put a number on it. She and I went through some stuff after we got mixed up with a really dangerous crowd. You mean the Order of the Circle? Tama told me about it. What? Well, well, if she dropped that name, then your Tama must be the same as the one I knew. What the shnoise is going on, anyway? Well... Dude, really? I do not remember that. Tama... did that? Hmm... I still don't fully buy it, but... Say she did sacrifice her lives. To what end? It almost sounds like the Guardians of Time. Guardians of Time? Beings from the realm of fantasy. Who keep watch over this big clock. And use people's lives so as to alter the course of our history. Preposterous, right? As credible as tea-stealing fairies. A clock that intervenes in history? That sounds just like that girl's tea room. <laughs> You're right! Huh? So, does that make her a... Guardian of Time? Make who? Okay. Well, now let's see if I can go get back Tama. And get back up to almost full strength. Wow. So this is what the inside of this place actually looks like. Wait, Guardians are real? Does this mean that fairies who steal your teeth are too? Hmm? Are you here for tea? I don't think I was expecting guests. Oh yes. I may very well have collected her lives. But whatever's done is done. <gasps> I cannot return any lives that were spent to traverse time. Sorry. But, but there's gotta be... There must be some secret trick. A secret trick? Hey! I have an idea. Why don't we track down a QB? Aren't they part of the same tribe of mirages that Tama is? Huh? To manipulate time, Tama used more than one of her lives, right? If I'm not mistaken, she had what? About nine lives in total? What if we swapped some of her lives out? Then we could go back before she made her sacrifice and replace some of her lives with the lives of a QB instead. She turned time back so far she needed to use nine lives? Hmm... But you may be onto something. A mirage from the same tribe with the same kind of soul could offer some souls in Tama's place. You mean it? But, Seraphie, dude! Now that's a secret trick! Hmm? Oh! oh. Why did you say again? <laughs> okay. If you can bring me a QB, I'll help you out. 
Now, normally this would be a little bit more of a pain, but so I already like, have one. The QB is a mirage? Because I haven't seen one. Where do we find it? I'll try the rumor radar. I limit the search to Urugus and other fox like mirages like Tama. Oh. Look out, kids. I think we have a winner. What do you mean, winner? It seems that some lady was killed in the Ceronian ice fields by a giant black fox. Or so I heard. In that case, Charlotta might know more about it. Let's go! I guess I have to do the story for this, though. So that's fine. So I got two things I gotta do. I need to go and talk to Shiva Ifrit Ramu. Which isn't a problem. That's just a thing. Uh, let's see, figure it out. No, that's not gonna. Where am I going? That'd be the ice region? Probably. Uh, when's it? Meyer Valley 7, Dragon Scars, Rainbow Shore, Low Seas, Seronia Ducks, Icicle Ridge? Icicle Ridge. Oh, I would have just gone to the ice region. You know, I don't remember where things are sometimes. Or the best way to get to them, at least. <laughs> anyway, let's go ask a question. If I have to use the tea room for this, though, which I probably do. <laughs> anyway, I don't think I need to imprison it. I just need to have it. Yeah, ice region would be much faster. You're here about the black fox? Wait, what do you mean? Hmm. I knew the woman who was killed. She was... my aunt. Huh? What? Huh? Wait, if she's your aunt, she's gotta be. She has to be. Yes. That's correct. She was Uncle Taka, I mean, the Thane of Saronia's wife. Hang on. If that's a coincidence, it really is creepy. Tell me, why do you need to find that black fox? You wanted to share its lives? Well, good luck with that. I figured. Not the sharing type. It doesn't matter. We should still try to get our hands on its prismarium. Then why not let me help you out? I can take you to where the fox is. Refia, are you sure? Yes, I'll be fine. And Rain and Lon will be there. Whoa, whoa. Let's not forget I'm going to. Oh, of course. Goes without saying. Mm-hmm. That's more like it. Okay. Well, you be careful out there. Hmm. Oh, and you don't have to turn into a cat and follow us this time. I know, I know. Just get going. You yep. Okay, so, man, do I have to talk to Refia for this, or I'm here. Nope, we just go. So, uh, where is this black fox hiding out? It should be an icicle ridge. There's a path, separate from the one that leads to the harbor. It's a little harder to find. Well, why don't I go on ahead? See you at the entrance! So yeah, now I have to go through that again. It's a bit of a pain, but what can you do? So the main thing I'm going to have to be careful of here is I need to keep a... Uh, I want to keep a reserve so I can just immediately Bahamut. But if I don't, that'll be fine. I'll just have to defend that a couple of turns. Build up a strong water port. Over here. Dude! 
never would have found this. I mean, mm -hmm. it's on the map. This is the place where he lost her. Uh, yeah! uh, what the? It's coming from over there. Hurry! <laughs> Why that mirage? Why do I loathe it with every fiber of my being? If you were my Uncle Taka, then of course you would despise that mirage. Hmm? Is that Refia? And you? Uh, hiya. <laughs> Once again, I feel the pull of destiny. Boy, am I really not glad to see you. Tell me, Refia. Why is it natural? I would hate that thing. You can tell me first. Who am I really talking to? Me. A knight of the Bahamutian army. But this flesh I inhabit belonged to the human you so lovingly called Taka. His body? Then you've possessed him? So, then, where is he? Dead for quite some time now. <gasps> Monster! Is that what you consider honor? Oh no. Those are the rules of this world. The human body is a weakness, the door most easily breached. Uh. Enough of this. You will answer my question. Why do I bear such incredible enmity for that mirage? That guy whose body you're camping out in? His wife was killed by that mirage. If you look at that fox and feel hatred for it, it means his memory? No. His soul still lives on inside of you. That's absurd! No trace of him could remain. And yet, the hatred inside of me, it is unmistakable. <laughs> oh, I see! Another twist of fate! Yes! Of course! And your arrival is one of the resulting kinks! I see it! Fascinating! Let us test this portentous bond, and see just how fast it holds! So... What? Uh-oh. If we let that karmic kook find the black fox and kill it, won't that ruin all of our chances? Oh, let's go after him, Rain! Right! Okay, now that that dialogue's done, let's get going. Which again, if you weren't paying attention in the last part, or haven't seen it, which, hey, VODs, you can always get caught up whenever you want. But uh, any combat I get into or cutscenes will just interrupt the dialogue and sometimes skip lines. So I'm just kind of waiting it out to start moving until that dialogue finishes. Getting all those quips in and out. So, yeah. Good, we beat him to it. It's a straight line. <laughs> you know what? It's fine. This the culprit we're after, Seraphie? Well, it does look exactly like Tama does in her more regal form. All right, then let's imprison it. Oh, but don't forget that it has multiple lives. For now, forget about imprisoning it. You should focus on defeating it. All right, then that's what we'll do. Lon, you ready? Right on. And then it can give us its souls! <laughs> All you need now is a hood and a scythe. Okay. So... It's, it's, it's unimprisonable, yeah. Well... Time to do what I've just been doing. <laughs> Bring up the Hobbit! See how much damage this one can do to me. <sighs> Speed up, hold down my... Come on, come on. Yeah. 
Again, we've seen this. I can have an ex I have a speed up button. I can't do it to skip these, but yeah. Gets a little flashy when I do it, so that's fine. Poison bite! Oh, that's actually kind of good. Probably. Because, hey, poison damage. That'll tick down. <laughs> Abyss. Not great damage, but it's fine. Touchdown. Mega Flare. Yeah, so this is pretty much my strategy for pretty much here on out. <laughs> I nuked that. That's more health than it has. Yeah, so. Your life is mine! <laughs> What now? My heart. The anger that held it has given way to something far worse. That's Uncle Taka. What he would feel. My uncle would never hurt anyone, not even a fly. And he never tried to take revenge for my aunt. No matter how much you hate someone, when you lash out, it just leaves you empty. He always said so. Empty. So this is how it feels to be human. Watch out! If it's like Tama, we have to assume this thing has got nine lives. Well, how many does it have left? No wonder the thing wouldn't die, no matter how many times I've killed it. <laughs> so be it. Lon, these shiny things must contain the Black Fox's lives. Dude, nice! So, it seems this body, and with it my soul, must expire. It's down to two lives. That's all you left it with. You must have had a grueling fight. And yet I have nothing to show for my great struggle. Nothing at all. Uh. And now, it seems, my time to leave this world has come. If I may ask you one favor. See, this man is buried alongside his beloved wife. Uh. Okay. I will. Did Refia leave already? Yeah. They're going to hold a proper funeral in Seronia. Gotcha. Well, Refia's a strong girl. She's gonna be all right. Anyway, I suppose I should head over there and make myself useful. You going on all fours? Like I told you, it's very simple. Cats get around? You know it. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, who wants to go back to Ninewood Hills and bring that girl the QB lives we got like the bad mom bombs we are? Sounds good. Yeah, now I do actually have a QB for other purposes. But yeah, so that's all done. I can now get Tama back, which means I can get a decent stack again. <laughs> I will also say that, uh, technically speaking, I'm almost positive Sylph. Is also a placeholder for my final parties. Huh? Where is the QB? Were you only able to acquire its souls? Huh? Oh no. Did we botch up the job? Hmm. It's a little unorthodox, but this could work. What do you mean? Since you brought two, we'll use one to spin a new thread and give Tama the other. So that she'll have a life to spare when the time comes. 
Cool. Whatever that means, let's do it. Okay. I'll do my best to keep the changes to a minimum. You don't have to stay here and watch. Um, are you sure? It's a lot to explain. Not to mention the long ritual. And since time is going to change, you won't remember anyway. And there we go. Hello, Rain. Anybody home in there? Huh? Maybe she's so tired of your antics, she finally the flatlined. Look at the what you've reduced her to. Whoa, 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 whoa. I have never anticked once in my entire life. You don't even know what the word antics... Rain? Then what's the matter? Huh? What? I... I was just really happy to see you was all. That's weird. Oh, it's okay. Messages of life. Yep. Okay. Awesome. So now I have Tom back. Which is good. But I need to... <laughs> I need to switch some things around, unfortunately. So that's... That is what it is. Uh, prism case. You hear it? So... Uh, I don't think I need Zapped anymore, so I think I can get rid of you and... Hey! I... Really? Seraphie's on max? Okay, I thought I used her. It's fine. So this is my QB. I actually trained it up, it's good. Anyway, let's... Yes. That's fine. Okay, so I'm still using Omega. I don't necessarily need Mord Skull. Who do I want to... I do want to bring in Seraphie, but she's also still weak. Uh, I want to keep Ifrita. I want to keep Ifrita. I need to keep some of these... I'm going to get rid of Ultima. Like, Ultima's just not strong enough. <laughs> Sadly. <laughs> you know? So, let's bring in Seraphie. She's not going to get any direct combat, but that's fine. Um, you seem to have something sitting on your head there. What's the deal with that? Huh? <laughs> How did that get there? You didn't even notice? <laughs> oh boy, what a doofus. Uh, have you checked your head? Uh, how did that get there? Ha ha ha. Oh boy, what a doofus. Both of you are doofuses! Hey, the word is doofy! Here, I'm giving you this, so let's just move on. Uh, thank you. But what is this for? The truth is... <sighs> I haven't the foggiest. <laughs> I guess when I go out for a walk, stuff just finds its way onto my head. Well, from now on, whenever you see some thingamabob parked on my noodle, you just go ahead and help yourselves. Neither. Okay. Well, now we're all good. So, there's one more thing I need. Yeah, well, a couple more things. Now I need to go deal with Odin, Bahamut, all that. Before that, though, I'm going to save in case something goes terribly wrong. <laughs> it's gonna kick off. The, it's gonna kick off uh, visuals, but that's fine. Okay. So. There we go. We're back. <laughs> but yeah, so... Where's Dungeon? Uh... Which one? So, should be Nether Nebula? Yes. So what we gotta do is go talk to those three again. I assume. 
That's not what I wanted. I want the other one. Here we go. Hmm? That's treasure. I don't need treasure. Could be a mimic. Non-zero chance of mimic. The mimics are just a pain. So everything in here I should still be able to one-shot. Just kind of force my way through, so we should be fine. And a preem? Oh, lovely. Yeah, even on Nightmare, I'm still really strong for this region. Yeah, I really do want to get Seraphie some levels, but... Because I would have loved to have her in place, but... Again, I used that Sylph for so damn long, and having Whisper Wind was just too useful. That reminds me... Oh, Tom is immediately put back in stacks. That's great. I love that. Tama is back in her rightful place. On Lon's head. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, 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 And... Deep. Yeah. Uh, let's see, what do we have? What's the cheapest thing I can do to kill them all? Should have a thunderbolt. Yeah, thunderbolt. Yeah. All right. Worked like a charm. Come on, let me down. Yeah. So the reason I don't think I need zap though is I don't think there's any more puzzle stuff for me to do. I think I've technically gone through all the dungeons. I don't need to activate any more of these things. Because those are all for secret areas at this point. <laughs> now, I can't just... Uh, I guess I gotta do something in the tea room. Because I just need to talk to those three and get them back. Fine. Well, that was a waste of my time. Oh, well. Let's double check some rumors. Or Maybe I don't need to? Hey, what can I talk to you about? So weird. I feel like I've missed you, but that doesn't make sense. Well, it's kind of a long story. You don't think you could maybe elaborate? I can't explain how the great it is to see you. I feel so warm and the fuzzy inside. Tinkle, 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 tinkle. tinkle, tinkle. Warm and the fuzzy on the inside. Cold and wet on the outside. Therapy is in charge of taking the... Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, I guess I don't need to do any more. It's fine. Mmm. You know, this is kind of a silhouette of a person a little bit on the clock. Just a little bit, though. Like, just kind of arms in the sleeves a little bit. It's, it's interesting. At least it could be taken. There's a lot of ways you can take that, but, you know. Good evening. What now? Just a weird observation. Who's so uh, micro envy. <gasps> oh, let's do this. This sounds fun. <sighs> I should have known it wouldn't be easy. Huh? Seraphie. Were you looking for me? Huh? Oh, no, no. Since we're both pixies, I thought, hey, I may as well ask her about transfiguration. Hmm? Transfig? Why now? Now that Thomas learned to transfig and get all godlike, I can't help but feel a bit... I don't know if I'd say jealous. Uh, it's more like, really, it's just a pang. Just a smidge of micro-envy. Just a smidge, huh? <laughs> it sounds tough, 
You have to go toe to toe with high level mirages. I'm not sure I'm cut out for it. Non combatant and all that. Glee! Huh? You want to help her out? Hmm. <laughs> How's this? Maybe we three can help you out a smidge. Really, dude? That's sweet. Uh, I did not mean to channel Lon just now. Hmm? Wait a sec. We three? Never mind. Now, Siren, call in a high-level mirage. Slow down. I'm not sure I'm ready for this. Oh, it'll be fine. Right? Hey, who are you talking to now? <laughs> hey, when did you get on board? <laughs> I don't remember doing this. I probably did, but... I guess that means Wynn is on to us, huh? She definitely knows what's the up. But how the come I have to work my butt off just to help Seraphy? That doesn't seem right at the all. Well, just pretend you're helping us collect mirages. Except I don't think this mirage is too happy about being collected. Yeah, it's fine. It's Bahamut time again. <laughs> Why am I not able to speak this one up? There we go, now we're speeding up. Oh good, I can just hit the button to skip it. Lovely! I do like that damage. Oh wow, you can take glares like a boss. Ooh, this is fun. Oh, you are dead. <laughs> you are, uh, yeah. <laughs> so I can't skip Mega Flare. Or can I? Yeah, no. Yeah, so we can just beat it up. Gets all blue. Fires like absolutely massive blast. Yeah, doing more damage than it has health. Yeah. This was so actually bad. the strategy. I, I think I used the strategy similar to this for the super boss. But it gets kind of tricky because I had to keep summoning Bahamut. And uh, that tactic really only use, works once. Because it takes 20 to be able to summon him. See? Told you to be fine. <laughs> My time has come! I shall rule on high! Now, no mirage can stand in my way! Not so fast. The only reason you won just now is because Lon and Rain were there to help you out. Huh? Well, they can do that? Sure can. You must have sensed them there. By your side? Hmm... I don't know what's going on, but... The important thing here... Is that I won. Right. Now that my prismarium has gotten just a little more robusty, I expect to do great things. Lon, rain. So yeah, that does remind me. I should probably check her mirage board. <laughs> so Thomas is fine. Seraphis is blank. <laughs> that might actually explain some things. Area, magic defense, blank space, magic plus, magic plus, sync bonus, tickle, pharmacology, confuse, accuracy, balance, yep, evasion, diva, seraphy. Maybe I never did use her, I just... I wanted to, but I just don't think I did. Silent voice. Mm. If Seraphie doesn't have Whisper Wind, though, that would be a bit of a problem, wouldn't it? Arioga, huh, you say? So, I need to get those, but I don't remember where to get those. Uh, I can 
shit, what did I take off? Uh, I guess there... So I know I didn't have that equipped. No, I, was it Thundaga? I got it. No, got Romeo on. How do I do a Ben Siphon? Probably. No, that didn't do my other. I don't know what you had. That's a problem. It was some ability, and I'd like to remember what it was. Kiraga's still equipped, so that's fine. Uh, there we go. We'll discard the Arioga, because we're getting another Arioga. And Auto Phoenix. As far as the little HP, that sounds fun, but what I think I want. Again, I, I'd rather focus on damage. Yeah, I know. So. You don't get Whisper Wind. <sighs> then again, that could be a st um, yeah, which is why I like Sylph. But let's see, yeah, see Whisper Wind. That's why I. <laughs> it's one of the reasons I like it. So you get what do you get instead of Whisper Wind though? Uh, uh huh. Let's see. You get confused. Okay, yeah, that's just not worth it to me. Uh, I guess I should also level up and order while I'm here. He should have enough to max out most of his stats. Yeah, Odin is also very physical oriented. In case you couldn't tell. Alright, what is the mirror jewel you wanted me to pick up? Because I was not paying attention to it. Strength, there is a strength down. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I know. Like, the thing is, is, like, mirror jewels do give me a lot of variability in how I can configure stuff, and that's kind of why I did it. Uh, so for you, what do you want? HP to all allies. Uh, let's just throw the damage on you. <laughs> that seems like the best choice to me. So, yeah... I guess what I could do is use Diva Seraphy for something. But I think this is a fine setup for now. Okay, so where were we? What, what now? <laughs> yeah, the funny thing is these five stars just can't touch a fully maxed Muhammad. Uh, okay. Diva Seraphy, yeah, all the things I already, I guess I already have. Uh, the Intom. Uh, yeah, let's go grab the others and then we'll keep working down the list. Yep. 
don't carry any more high potions. That's just fine. So, I guess I just need to keep working down this list. We'll knock out all of these and then we'll figure out what I need to do. But I guess knocking all these out will help. So. I thought the Cogna were on a rampage in this town. I know that I heard right, but I don't see any sign of them. What's this? Ami, you're doing a brave thing. It'll be over soon. Can we count on you? Yes. I promise to see it through to the end. Pardon? This young lady here, Ami isn't planning to go out there and take on the Cogna. Huh? Oh, well, uh... It's not like that. Let me explain what's going on. Miss, um... Oh, uh, you know we'll be fine. Those mechanical monsters... They're called Cogna, and they're dangerous. How do you hope to stand against them? Don't go out there. The League of S has better fighters. The point isn't for me to fight it. My job is just to lead it away. What? Those Cogna, or whatever you call them. Trying to fight them would be foolish. We know that. But if we don't act, it's only a matter of time before they take control of the town. So you see, we came up with a rule here. We take turns, and each household has to send out a decoy, as long as they're focused on somebody else. The Cogna will stay away from the town. And now it's my turn. I'm going. But that's... Ami, once they spot you... You don't have to tell me what I already know. Several others have gone out there before me. As you may have guessed, none of them ever made it home. No! I won't let you do this! Let's contact the League of S for help. Then we can... You're welcome to call for all the help that you want. But I've made up my mind. I'm doing my part. While you wait for the League to get here, someone still has to slow those things down. How can you say that? You're willing to sacrifice your life? Well, it's only one life, right? If that buys some hope for the rest of the town, then so be it. Even a little hope is preferable to no hope at all. And besides, now that my turn has come up, I can't say... Oh, never mind. Listen, this is my decision to make and I've made it. So please, try and understand. <sighs> hey, um, Yuna, right? Do you mind if I ask you one small favor? It's my mother. I was hoping that you could say goodbye for me. I'd do it myself, but I don't want to lose my courage. Tell her I love her. You know, it's kind of funny having Yuna resist what is essentially what she did in 10. She said that? My sweet Ami. Lady Yuna, thank you for delivering the message. Ma'am, are you sure about this? Because you'll never... When was I ever able to make her choices for her? It's not like I'll be far behind her. Stop that. I'm sorry, but this isn't right. This... this can't be the solution. Ami thinks she's giving you hope. But her dying will only take more of your hope away. It doesn't make any sense at all! Don't think that I don't know that. I've been screaming it in the back of my head from the moment she left. But... She's so stubborn sometimes. And I couldn't... Lady Yuna! Please! Please save my daughter. I can't keep pretending this is okay. It's not. Don't worry. I will bring Ami home. <gasps> Where am I? What are you doing? That girl has already made her decision. What gives you the right to stand between her and her choices? And who are you? Do you respect her resolve so little you would trample all over it? No, it's not that. But you know exactly why she made the choice she did. You accepted it and allowed her to go. 
You agreed that small sacrifices must be made for the good of the many. I'll admit, I did try to convince myself of that, and I almost let myself believe it. But no, what's wrong is wrong. A world of loss, of sacrifice, I won't have it. My choice is to look for a better choice. Then prove to me that you can endure. Do you really think you possess the strength to shield the world from tragedy? I shall be the judge of that! Okay, fighting Valfor. Hey, uh, sorry to butt in while you're trying to test Yuna's strength. You don't mind, right? The strength of friends is the greatest strength of all. Wow, slap that onto a greeting card ASAP. Yep. Incredible power. Yes, yes, yes. Loading. There we go. <laughs> the problem is, is I resist pretty much everything. And yeah, I could do lesser attacks and like give more opportunity, but you know how it is. It's not worth it to me. I didn't even get to the Mega Flare. Predictable. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> this part can always be called Bahamut, the king of death. <laughs> king of destruction. You have proven the depth of your resolve. I offer you all of my power. Wield it now as you see fit. Don't do this! Yuna? No one should have to sacrifice herself for others. It's wrong. I won't allow it. No more. Oh, that's why it's easy. So we're just gonna defend up. Uh Full power, oh no. Oh, we're okay. We're okay. Yeah, we're just gonna defend this up. Max out our gauge again and then uh, call in Bahamut. Because fortunately, uh, Ultima is slow as little hell. Bahamut, again! Yeah, as I said, this is the strategy. We're not mixing it up, we're not making it... We're not gonna go like, hey, let's make this spicy and someone bumping it's not gonna work. No, we're just gonna do this. It's one of the things that saddens me about New Game Plus going, hey, you can't keep story mirages. And this is one of the most powerful story mirages. Like, by far. The amount of strength this thing has, like, that Bahamut brings to the table is... Just immense. Wow. Oh, hey. Abilities. Mega Flare. This could kill. This might not kill. But it's certainly gonna hurt. Yep. That's kill. No, it's not? Oh, I thought it was. Okay. Damn, hung on with like one or two HP. Well, that ought to do it. Oh, yeah. I mean, it doesn't really matter. <sighs> okay. I mean, the thing I'm really working for right now is maxing out Omega. I was probably using Mithril or something. Are they here? I can feel it. Thank you for being there for me. I admire your courage and resolve, but Ami, you need to think of those you're leaving behind. 
Your mother's waiting for you. Yuna. I'm so sorry. Thank you. There's always a better choice out there. So don't give up. Again, I like non-fatalist Yuna. Where she's not like... Yeah, we're... Got like it's one of those things I always hold against Ted is Yuna's just so eager to martyr herself. It's like, come on. It's like if there is a choice of hey, if they're like intent, if there was a choice of hey, if there was like multiple choice and any one of them was was Yuna martyring herself, she almost always went for that choice. It took you know, basically Tina's going hey that's dumb don't do that <laughs> at several points. It's just also uh, Riku and so many things. She's much better in Ten Two, and I think Ten Two is a better story Good and evening. game, despite how Good wild now. it is. But you mostly, I just don't like. Like I, I don't like Tens. Like Titus is just a pain in the ass for so many reasons in the dub, like in the original, and you know. I don't really much care for how uh, Yuna acts either, and the rest of the party. Walk is fun. <laughs> Walk is fun at times. Uh, Maka was fun. Riku was great. Uh, Aurat is just like he's cool, but he's also kind of an asshole for most of the thing because he knows what's going on, and then just like hey, I'm not gonna tell you. And Kimari's just there. Like, he's the token blue mage and makes it, which kind of makes him worthless. Not too shabby, all things considered. Now I'm ready for a blast of epic scale. A real heavy hitter. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I can rant on Ten for a while. Um, Lon, is it just me or does this raise all kinds of red flags? Yeah, there's no telling what that crackpot is cooking up. What do you think? Maybe we should check in on them. Hey, what are you doing here? Oh, Titus, perfect timing. Do you know where Dr. Shantoto might be? You need the doc? She's out taking an extended swim. Drank that concoction of hers and went to the temple. The sunken temple? She dove right in with this ear-to-ear -ear grin and was all like, ah! <laughs> And here I thought she hated swimming. Well, hope we didn't come all the way down here for nothing. Ah! I huh? Oh! So Lady Giant has returned for another visit. It's been nice to see you again. Oh, yes, the fluffy mirage. Very good, then. Marvelous timing. What's up? A jaw? Who invited the man thing? Uh, my bad? I feel an unusual giddy sensation. Enough! Man thing is to keep its distance from me. Okay. Rain, was it? The Lady Giant's name? Rain person must listen. Um, sure. Well, I have decided I must run away. But run away? Why? Alas, I am not even certain. I heard... Ah! <laughs> and this human person appeared, who then made an attempt on my royal life. I mean, those wretched Tomberries, they were finally behaving. Everything was fine. The Guanchos, we were getting on with our lives. And I just thought, I thought I could have some peace and quiet. Tell me, why do humans find such sport in picking on me? Um, please try to calm down. <laughs> hey, Juan. <laughs> That's got to be Dr. Shantoto, right? Oh, there is no doubt about that. Uh, human bullies! Don't worry, because Lon here, he's gonna teach that mean human personal lesson. 
okay? Please don't cry. Do what? I don't. He will. Uh, 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 sure. No problem. I'm feeling that same sensation again. Um, what? Look, a girl's heart is a complicated thing. That is so the true. She's not the only girl who's got it the rough. Huh? Who? Where? Another girl? Dude! Oh! Don't you pretend I'm not a fox? You're such a big, stupid, fat, the headed dum dum! <laughs> Come on now, Rain. You do realize that I have like zero chance of beating Dr. Shantoto. Then you shouldn't have promised. Well, I agree. You're probably doomed. But let's go and see what she has to say. Okay. Mm, damn, now I gotta walk through this whole place again. This will not be as easy as me trying to go find Ifrit in them. Actually, I'm ready no. when you are. I do have thought, but I do have a. Uh, I have thunder things. So I already have thunder. Uh, I don't know what I give up. Oh yeah, well, it's fine. All right, predictable. Not my favorite thing to deal with, but it's just fine. Anyway, as I was saying, I could rant a lot about why I don't like ten that much, but into story system so many things but you know there's a lot of people that really enjoyed and love that game and that's fine you're entitled to your opinions and I don't have to agree with those I won't <laughs> uh, but I won't always I'm just gonna always I'm my own person I'll form my own opinions thank you very much I will this say the no music was pretty great again and that's uh, that, it's weird that it's kind of my go-to thing. We're like, hey, I didn't enjoy the game. But the music was good. You know? So. Because I'll say the same thing about Chrono Cross. That's an entirely different matter. Well, that ought to do it. Oh, yeah. One which I'm not getting into. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I will... I think, I think the difference there is, like, I have a lot of things against 10, and it's just, like, not not my favorite thing at all. Whereas, I think Cross is a fine game. However, I think it is an absolutely terrible sequel to Chrono Trigger. And that's why I don't like it. And a lot of the things they did to tie them together are just terrible. Absolutely terrible. Not to mention, like, and the changes oh, between please, the two. Don't like... like, as its own standalone thing, I think Cross is fine. But... <sighs> That's the thing. It's not a standalone. It's very much, like, tries to buy a lot of trigger, Chrono Trigger lore, and put it into a whole new context. And it just... It does a bad job. You did it! Wasn't so bad. Uh, maybe I would not be as critical of it if they didn't go, hey, we killed one of the original party members and made two of them go missing by something that really shouldn't have stood a chance against them. Then use childlike forms of them to insult your current party, which made me more inclined to be all like, yeah, that's right. They don't know what they're doing, you know? It's mainly after you've been through so much with uh, that team. It's very much like, yeah, I can see where you're coming from on all of this. You know? My sweaty informants brought a surprise. They said that you are currently plotting my untimely demise. What? But those guys haven't even got any mouths on them. Just who do you think you're talking to, dear? You'll find I'm far more resourceful than I appear. <laughs> but as I was saying, when I help you out and get this kind of thanking, then you leave me with no choice but to start doling out spankings. Whoa, just hold up. Shall we begin? Oh, dude! 
You don't stand a chance. I got Bahamut. What you All got? Right, Lord, you can do this. Why do I have to do it? Yeah, yeah. I could also call a champion, but what I am is do Bahamut. Like champions are fine for first, and I think when I have to face what's his face. I forget it there. Big evil final boss here. I am going to hit him with something. And then we're gonna get down to it. Yeah, that's fine. You poisoned me. I want that. <laughs> See, this is one of those things where it's like, I want to get hit with things. The problem being here is that Shantoto is very magical. So, I'm not gonna do a shit ton of damage here, you know? I could defend. Holy shit! Oh wait, I was only, only doing that much damage, so it's fine. Defend! Uh, Really? Okay, what am I looking at here, then? She has dropped, so soon, presumably she can die. Let's see if I can resummon Bahamut. I want to do right now Kira defend yeah those blizzagas are hurting so let's Kira back up uh, let's also Regin Defending this off. Bio is fine. Here we go. Mega Marat. No, that's not what I, that was not what I wanted to do. I it ate it input kinda. Oh, I can only summon the more. Well. That is a problem. So throw Banashira at him. Very possible that I am supposed to lose. But the thing is, is that every other fight I'm supposed to lose is hit way harder than this. But at the same time, this fight is incredibly tanky, which is leading me to believe that it is possible that I'm not supposed to win this. Weak to Quake. Okay, that's fine. I'm going to throw a champion at you. Let's do Sephi. How much damage does that do? 16,000. 
Not bad. Everyone should be attacked up, so let's just throw some attacks on them. Sundaga! We got an absorb in there? Oh man, that's great. Uh, do you have a Kira that I can throw on Lost? God, he got hit with a bad attack. And nearly died. Throw some fox fire, why not? So, I'm beginning to think this is a fight I'm supposed to lose, but... I am very much not gonna throw a fight that I can win. That I think I can win. Ah, uh, so... Okay, we're gonna defend. You are gonna cure it yourself. Yeah, we're gonna keep defending a bit. I want to... The plan, I think, is gonna be... Well, plan's gonna be for me to just spam Flare. And then uh, heal as necessary. Four thousand damage! Yeah. That seems like the move. And if I feel I'm healed up, then I'm going to just... Yeah, I'm gonna spam melee. Except for from my caster, because, yeah. I need to just get those uh, stacks up as fast as I can. Okay, so you could be throwing a blizzard. Yeah, you'll throw it on the bio. That's fine. I don't... The bio's not a problem. Yeah, so we're gonna... It's gonna take a while to jump through this help. But damn it, I am not about to just give in. This is more of me being stubborn, but I don't care. <laughs> Why lose a fight I can win? It's the real question. Okay, so... What we're gonna try is... Done it here right now. Yeah, it's not a terrible thing, but I think... Uh, I mean, again, I could try Odin, but I don't think that Odin is uh, good enough at this point. We're getting close, and I just don't want to... Okay, you're gonna stack bio on both of us. That's fine. Kira, stack it on them. See, this is why bio is a problem. <laughs> but, yeah. We're in a casting duel, and unfortunately for me... Unfortunately, both I need. Yeah. Lazaga. Yeah. Unfortunately for me, I'm at a disadvantage because I have weaknesses and she does not. <laughs> However, I have Cure and she does not. So it kind of works out. Okay. So that's why I kind of want to just spam defends, is if something like that happens. And also because it'll get my AP up. I need to make sure I have enough AP to always react, regardless of what gets thrown at me. You know? Uh, I could try Holy. See if that does more than 400, like a 4,000 damage. Yeah, okay, stick with Flare. Defend. Holy's not worth it. Yoga. Yeah. <laughs> You're just gonna probe at my defenses, but unfortunately for you, I have healing. 
So we're gonna be. What I'm gonna do is Regen, Rain. Uh, I'm gonna now Faith Rain. We're gonna do something very risky, but. And by that, I mean I'm going to attack. Yeah, I thought that was going to come at me. It's fine. I got, there's a reason I'm watching my health for this sort of thing. But if she's not able to one-shot me, I'm, I'm, I am just going to tank this fight out. And we're going to make it a pain in the ass. All involved. <laughs> Okay, well, that's fine. Hmm. Regin, my yeah. So that's the thing. Bio automatically counteracts Regin. And that's kind of a pain in the ass, but it is what it is. Yeah, I thought you'd try that shit. Abilities. Throw a flare. Yeah, this is just getting to be a slog. It is what it is, though, so... Doesn't matter what gets thrown at me, I can survive it now, so... Unfortunately... Oh, we're good. I got another Cura. Yeah, so this is just, again, this is one of those fights where it's like, yeah, technically speaking, I can win this, but I'm not sure that that's, uh, you know, that's the smartest use of my time. <laughs> anyway, so just spam defend until I have AP to actually work with anything. I'm also at a danger yeah, for that. So, that's fine. Yeah, so there's a reason I keep Flare always on this point as much as I can. <laughs> now, the real funny thing to me is I'm rebuilding up my champion gauge that I spent. Yeah, so that's the other thing. Another Kira, just to keep that topped off. If I really wanted to, I could throw a haste on there, but I think that's not the smartest play, actually. Well, let's see, where are we at? Uh, let's throw face that on. Yeah. So, here's the thing. I don't know if I'm supposed to beat her, but I'm going to. It's basically all I can say. And if you keep throwing the wrong elements at me, then I don't have a problem here. Regin. I'll throw it on myself. I'll throw it on Rain. On Lawn. Sorry. Okay. And we still got another one going on here. Because I will keep pounding on that defense as long as I can. Sweet. Okay, and now... Yeah, so that's the other thing I can do. I'm also got pretty good health, so we're gonna reg and rain and just... Yeah, again, it's great. <laughs> the problem is, is now I have to assume it that. So that countered my heal there, so that's fine. But I'm not super happy about it. 
Yeah, I'm losing a thousand damage for not having that up. For not having uh, Faith up. Okay, so I could heal or I could regen more, which I think I'm gonna regen. See if I can bait up the bio. Again, I'm getting a thousand points back and I'm getting three turns, so. It doesn't matter what she's throwing at me if I can just defend it off. See, we're getting a slow but steady kill here, and that's the thing that's kind of like, hmm. But you know what I'm going to do just to speed this up? We're going to throw Sora out there. I've never used Repia, and that's a damn shame. This would not be advisable in any way. Like, this is too much resources lost for a single fight. But at the same time, what does it matter? Critical for 36k. What are you at? So <laughs> way too much health. Uh, okay, so here's the thing. You will defend. Attack. Defend. 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 Uh, what I want. Yeah, I really just don't have physical abilities, and that's kind of my problem. Uh, arise. It's useful for other things. Isuna yourself. So that hit way harder than Sephiroth did, I think. Sephiroth only did like 16k. Made it actually a worthwhile expenditure, if I'm being honest. Uh, face that. But we still gotta keep chewing through. Like, I could also, uh, the other option I have here is I could just burn a shit ton of items to break it. But, there's a little tiny problem with that. I don't have a ton of items I'm just gonna willy nilly throw. See, the other thing that's making this a pain is just that. Hey! Keep throwing these and we'll get her down yet. She has dropped. She can die. That is the theory, anyway. Perfect. The dog is one of those abilities that I don't rightly care either way. So we're going to defend up here just so I have a... Yeah. Just so I have a faith on deck when I really want it. Like, I get it. Chantoto's tough, but come on. This is just so much HP I'm trying to jump through. I'll throw a faith on that.
At this point, I just want to get this done. This fight has gone on way too long. Oh, that actually hurt. But again, this is why you don't want to try... You want to keep the weakness overlap to a minimum. I'm not saying you can't do it and you can't survive it. But it is a hell of a time to uh, recover when one element just nukes you. So I'm just going to keep trying to beat the crap out of Toto. Again, this is probably be much easier if I wasn't, you know, all magic based because we're in a magic duel. Oh, this is dumb. Why didn't I just do this? We'll figure out some things here. Defend still. Son of a bitch. Ooh, brand new. So, Reg and Matt again. Okay. What? I have reflect. That should not have happened. Does Chantota just go, no, your reflect doesn't mean dick to me? Because if that's the case, I'm... I want a refund. <laughs> Basically... <laughs> it's a lot of, like... That should have done something. But... You know, it is what it is. I want to just make sure I have Reg enough at all times. Throw another flare! Come on, we're getting... This is just ridiculous how much he's taking. The thing that annoys me most is that I'm not... Well, I guess I could... We'll have another Sephiroth pretty shortly. I wonder, does Siphon work on you? It does! Well, that changes things. I mean, it's not, like, super powerful or anything. But it does mean I can get more turns out. Faster, theoretically. Like, if this actually prevented moves, I'd be thrilled by it, but it doesn't, so. Yeah, that's one weakness. Siphon! I mean, we're fine. It's not a big deal. This is the this is the war of attrition stats, and that's uh, very annoying. Hey, we got a crit. Abilities. Mm. 
This is very war of attrition. See, because she just can't kill me. <laughs> Even if I drop my guard, Shantoto does not do enough damage to me. Not that I'm doing a shit ton to her either, but this is very, very much the whole I will kill you before you can do it. Like, I will kill you eventually. Slightly faster than the heat death of the universe. That's what this battle phase is. <laughs> oh. Eventually, we're gonna get to a point where I just stop doing damage. I gotta be more careful of that. Oh, and you're poisoned? Well, that's fine, actually. You still got heals, so you'll live, but. God. So, we've had a shift in strategy here, in that she is targeting the shit out of what Juan is doing. Which is fine, I can just switch him to defense. Because, uh, yeah. Then! Which, yeah, he does fall victim to a minor problem there of, uh, yeah, bio. It's killing him slowly, but. As long as I can keep him above, uh, 12,000, we'll be okay. Yeah, I thought that'd be what you th thought that'd be your go-to. Cure that. Throw in the flare. And now I guess we're gonna have a moment of truth. Oh no no no, we're not quite there yet. Interesting. We're just really close. So, yeah. I mean, you've seen how hard these fights are supposed to be. A champion, I could heal, do lots of things, but it's fine. Uh, what I'm gonna do is, we're gonna send Sephiroth again. I just wish this game had the common decency of killing me if it was gonna try and kill me, you know? Like... I get it, you want to have boss fights that you're not supposed to win, but... You know, wipe! You need to throw an attack that wipes me out. But since I know they're com- since I know they're kind of coming, I just am- I'm being very hesitant about items. Okay, and then... Yeah, unfortunately now, we're in a right pickle. See, look, that is an empty bar. Now let's see what happens when I do this. Taking damage. I need to keep the defense up because, uh, yeah, that's actually a problem. Focusing on the defense. Yeah, everyone needs to defend for now. Because that was coming. Are you gonna die to this, or am I gonna have to do like three more? Because I will throw three more. <laughs> That's not a big problem. That was a misplay. Because, uh, yeah, I wanted to heal Lon, who is very close to death. Uh, 
Uh, just die already. Hit another flare. So we've now the turn. Oh, that's the win. Well, that ought to do it. Absolute pain in the ass. We got a ton of experience for it. I don't think they thought. I don't think that was supposed to be. And that's not an easy win, but we got it. Every other fight just stops letting me do damage, so. What's this? You children would dare my punishment to resist? Wait, just hold on for a second, Dr. Shantoto. L Lon and I are both really sorry. Uh, oh, oh, uh, very sorry. Forgive us. We'll do anything you want, so please. Anything? I can pardon you this time. <laughs> so, um, Doctor, why were you trying to do the Quacha Queen in again? Say I'm inclined to open the door at the heart of the shrine, but therein lies the hitch. You see, only Miss Birdbrain can access that particular niche, but if she happens to buy the farm, the door's defenses become, shall we say, easy to disarm. Yeah, uh... We'll have a chat with her and convince her to open the door voluntarily, so... Maybe you can find it in your heart to, I don't know, maybe not kill her? Oh, very well then. I thought for sure you'd prefer my approach. But ask her, if it's a subject you can broach. By the way, what's so special about that door, if it's okay to ask? Do not press your luck. Now find the she-bird and get that door unstuck! Uh, right! So... I jump? Let her through the door? But, Egans! Certainly not! The last queen made it abundantly clear that I was never ever to open! Oh, so you'd rather sleep with the fishes permanently? Whoa, Dr. Shantoto! Just hang on! Your Majesty? Uh, yes? Will you do it for me? Please, open the door. Whatever happens, I promise I'll make it right. Uh, if you really want me to, I suppose I could open the door this once. Kito! What? you? You'll do it? I love you! What did you say? Um, this is seriously starting to worry me on multiple levels. If I'm not fully healed for this, I'm in a bit of a spot. Now, anything was the word you used, I recall. Huh? Good. Go and have a ball. Demand you finish that thing at once. Why, dude? Is that Kraken? I forget. Oh, why did I tell her I would do anything? At least this should be easier than facing the dock. But I'd hate to think of what she'll do to us if we lose. Centrist. <laughs> so basically, we're done for either way. Oh, Yay yeah. for us! Yeah, so. <laughs> I mean, I beat the dock, so what do I care? So you want me to use fire here. I don't have fire. So what I'm going to do is just, um... We're going to build up enough, get Bahamut out here, and just end it. So this is the defensive strategy that this game kind of prefers. Because, look, I got so many turns using Defend that I built up enough AP to use this before I really took much damage. Like, this kind of has shown off why Defend is very useful. I'm also surprised it let me win an unwinnable fight. <laughs> I'm glad at least that one was, but I think it's because this is all option.
But yeah, so the good thing about this is that since I've already lost some health, it means I am more than capable. Oh, hey. <laughs> you really want to die. Oh, <laughs> I'm dead before Mega Flare. <laughs> yeah, I remind you that Shin Toto took a Mega Flare. <laughs> Didn't do much to Bahamut, but could take a Mega Flare. This guy did a ton to Bahamut, but couldn't take a Mega Flare. Kind of interesting. Huh? Well, that was easy. What? What's going on? The last queen warned me about this, but I refuse to believe her. When it expires. That monster will trigger a huge explosion with blastastrous consequences! Dude, what? Now you tell us? When you say huge, do you mean... Yes. The last time that Kraken Cracker boomed, the destruction it wrought split the entire continent in two! Dude, it what? But will the never escape that kind of Megaton in time? Be quiet! Huh? huh? Are you ready? Then tremble and quake. See the spell I've taken time to make. Now hold on to your hats. And take that! Huh? It seems my new magic is a great success. Dispel again. And its cancelling effects. What just happened? I might have known you pups would struggle so much to keep up. Once I learned that Tentacle Terror's life was getting close to ending, I devised a spell to contain the blast the creature's death was portending. I knew. Before it breathed its last, I'd have to unleash my new magic! My dispel again. It pacified this nightmare pelagic. So, your new magic... It wasn't meant for causing explosions? Oh, I tend to shun magic that has already been done. Uh, fair enough. Moving is for total losers. But I'll be able to stay in the safe now, thanks to you feeble-minded assistant diffusers. me out me too uh, tell me just what is the meaning of all this uh i guess everything worked out Acho? yeah you know that thing was set to blow whether we open the door or not it's true she wasn't exactly nice about it but it looks like dr shantoto saved us all and that's great news for you the sunken temple will be safe for good now huh? oh, i never realized who knew that human people were such benevolent organisms? Uh, I wouldn't say totally benevolent. Up until we stepped in, I'm pretty sure Dr. Shantoto was genuinely trying to kill her. Oh my, Rain, Lan, Quasho kind owes you dearly. Uh, Lan? Uh, yeah? You Make this strange sensation go away! Yeah, I and that's uh is that the end of that basically well let's go through the door and see what's on the other side i guess i got a door i should see what's here uh this is a secret area oh treasure can't get Kiraga. Water resistance plus plus. Resist blindness. Okay. <laughs> not, probably not worth the amount of beating I had to go through just to take down Shantoto. <laughs> like resource wise, that was a little bit of a bust. <laughs> but, it's done. <laughs> So, you know, sometimes explosive power won't get you through it, but you can try. 
And I'll, I'll note that uh, the super boss can take a lot of punishment. Like, that's... I came in pretty prepared. I think I still one-rounded it, but... Like, one-tried it, but... Oof. Anyway, I'm now out of the ability to summon champions. You don't get that back. But... Made good progress. So we're gonna do one more thing, and then... One more event, and then we'll call this a uh, stream. Hopefully it's not as long, but... <laughs> Some tea? What now? So we'll intervene in Who's one so more thing. Got the Sanchez, got Water Seed. So, Edgar, fair stuff by Cogna. Yeah, so. Yeah. We'll probably do a couple more of these, get that all said and done. I will double check that I don't have to do other things because I'm going to do other things. So yeah, okay. So I think I do need to do a ton of these. Anyway, we'll do one more of these and then we'll call that. And then uh, I'll be taking tomorrow off. Saturday and Sunday though, we will be playing Pikmin 4. It's going to be a fun time. Anyway. So, I'll get more of that in a bit. I'm not quite ready for closing. I don't know how long this is going to be. Could be short, could be long. I need a word, Edgar. Well, what have we here? If it isn't the Venus of the sea. Belay that nonsense before I dry heave myself to death. <laughs> Forgive me. I was just so overcome by your beauty. Ah, enough! Now tell me, what have you dredged up about that Cogna? Please, please. I find your courage intriguing, but I'd just as soon not have you stick out that beautiful neck of yours. That thing has damaged my ship and injured my crew. I would have seen to it myself if it hadn't fled inland. From what we've seen, it strikes at random by land, sea, and sky. And worse, it can adapt its shape to each locale. We have to hit it where we can, on solid ground and out on the water. But... Now that it's made an enemy of Figaro, I can assure you it won't get anywhere near your ship again. Please, leave the creature's disposal to us. How heroic. That monstrosity should rightly die by my own hands, but do the deed if you're so willing. Yes, I only ask that if I return home safely, you reward me. I know that that's settled. I'll be on my way. And if that thing does best you, you have my word that you'll be properly avenged. <laughs> anyway. Where are we? We call this site the Eye of the Desert. It's where Figaro Castle originally stood. It's in places like this and Big Bridge that you might, if you're especially lucky, see mirages that no one else has. You mean like brand new ones? Right. They appear in no legend or book. Not even in Tome Town's treasure trove of volumes. What's more, some have said that the Eye of the Desert could be connected to other worlds. What does it mean when worlds are connected? Something happens? Well, it means... <sighs> I knew it would just be a matter of time before it found its way back. Baby, look out! <laughs> I hate being right. Oh, dude! Legendary doesn't even begin to describe it. Not at all. I wonder what's going on in the world these things came from. I hmm. think we may have to look into that someday. Mm. Okay, so... It's weak to lightning, everything else is resistant to. That is fine. Uh, what are you again? Actually, you know what? Doesn't matter. Now we're just gonna do the same old, same old, summon Bahamut. And let the work get done. <laughs> oh, yeah.
uh, what? Hmm. That is perfectly fine. I don't think this can be countered, so... It is magical type damage, but I don't think it can be reflected. Yeah! That's max damage! <laughs> Victory! <laughs> Reflect worked against it. <laughs> Smart strategy, just not smart enough. <laughs> okay, I'm happy ending on that. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a pretty good workout, huh? What? That was the most powerful mirage I've ever seen. And you're telling me more of them will turn up here? Who knows, kiddo? But if it'll win me points with the world's loveliest ladies. Then I say go ahead and keep churning these nightmare adversaries out. Uh, I say please don't. Bibi, don't chicken out. You want to be single forever? <laughs> Whatever that mirage was, I don't think it came here just to attack without rhyme or reason. It wouldn't bother going out to sea except to do reconnaissance. Well... Whoever it's testing the waters for, I'm ready to guard the world's treasures. By which I mean, women. Ah, oh, yes. Edgar being Edgar. Okay. And with that, that is where we're going to call this. Next time we will finish out... Uh, we will try and... Well, hang on. Before I save and call it... We will, uh, but we'll finish out these remaining ones next time, so. We will have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll have these seven to do. And once they're done, I should be able to go in and finish the game, so maybe we'll do it next time. Or not. I don't know. See you soon. But yeah, so that's uh, that's what we're gonna call this stream. <laughs> We've uh, gotten back a lot of our strength. We're <laughs> quite capable now, and that's lovely. So yeah, that's where we're gonna call this. Um, so as I was saying, no stream tomorrow, but Saturday and Sunday I'm gonna start up Pikmin Four. We'll pick up from where I had that demo, where we had the demo save, and then we're going to go to town. That's going to be, like, the main thing of what we're doing. It's going to be fun for me. Because <laughs> that's a lot of why I like to stream. Is I like having fun, and I like being able to share that fun with others. So, not everyone's going to enjoy it, sure. That's fine. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not that, not that big on it. But, yeah. That is the current plan. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the stream. I enjoyed streaming it. Uh, so. Saving. And, uh, you know. I will, I hope to catch you next time. And have a good, uh, well, whatever time it is for you. Because <laughs> this was a fun stream for me. And I hope others could get some enjoyment out of this too. Because we're going to keep playing through games I enjoy. And uh, keep showing off stories I enjoy. Even if it means I don't talk a lot during them. But hey. You know. If, other, if I can bring joy to others in, in that way. That's fine too. So I'll see you when I see you. And with that. That is the end of the stream.